today I got Mo with me. We're hitting a little stretch up Gilbert, West Virginia on the Guy and Dot, a little class one. There's one class two on it. It's been raining the past couple days, so it's got the water back up. Uh, we did have a group ready to go with us, and everybody flaked out last minute. But me and Mo's still going to hit it. Um, have a little fun. Short run. It's kind of cool today. It's only in the 70s. So we ain't burning up or nothing, but hopefully that water ain't too cold. We're up here above Gilbert. Got the inflatable pumped up and ready to go. Most parking the car. We're gonna hit a couple miles here on the guy and dock, class one, class two. Water's brown like a cappuccino but it's not too big I think we're gonna have fun got me and Mo out here on the guy and dot go hit us some class one class two boogie what do you say Mo yeah oh we're good okay Keep it straight. See a branch in front of us in the water. We want to stay out of that. We don't want to get in that eddy though. We're good. We're good. We're good. We'll hit some buggy here. I wanted to hit right on that, but. <laughs> We had us a nice little river day. Experienced some little rapids. The flows were good. This is the closest white water to my house. It's only like 20 minutes up the road. It's an easy shuttle. The river basically flows right with the road. And this is a good beginner stretch of white water. It don't even show up on the whitewater page. The upper section above the <laughs> dam does. But this is a yeah. section I feel comfortable enough going down without having a Campbell or somebody with some know-how and some skills with me. I feel comfortable enough taking somebody else like Mo who doesn't have any experience, taking them with me, feeling safe. Did the ducky. Just because I'm trying to get Mo comfortable with the water and get him used to doing it. Maybe one day I'll put him in a hard boat. As far as hard boats go, seems like time and opportunity just stay in the mix to be able to get that boat out, get on some stuff that'll teach me some things. But, you know, as long as I'm on a river, I'm happy. Guy and Dots served me well over the past couple years. I look for it to do the same for many years to come. I'm happy on this little stretch. So I guess I'll be claiming this is my river. I don't ever see anybody else kayaking up here. Maybe a few fishing kayaks here and there. Nobody doing the white water, nobody hitting the rabbit. So it's mine. <laughs> does need some maintenance though. There's trash along the river. A few logs in it. Need to pulled, cut up or something. Woo. If anybody ever gets into that kind of stuff, wants to do a cleanup, wants to remove some logs, if you need some help, give me a yell. I'm into it.
just not why you were here! Hope you enjoyed the video if you're watching. We enjoyed making it. Had a good day on the river. Always good to be out there with friends, family, loved ones. I hope I inspire somebody to get out there and do the same. Get out there with your buds. Be safe. Have fun. Get outside, you know. Just finished up a little stretch on the guy and out here in Gilbert with Mo on the inflatable. We had a good day. The level was perfect. He got to experience some good rapids. That was a good fun day. Can't wait to do it again.